This caught my eye. In fact, I'm trying to decide if we need one. This is something that you always want to look for to save money. So this is one of my favorite types of videos to make. It's gonna be all about RV storage and organization, but this is probably from a source you're not expecting at all. So we are going to go to our first stop, head inside, and I'm gonna show you how to organize on the cheap. Let's go. All right, so we are at Ross, which Ross is like a discount store that you can find almost anywhere in the US. And just look at this, the bins, people, the bins. So there are all sorts of different types of storage bins here. These types that are flexible are some of my favorites. And this one's only $3.49. So for a nice, good quality bin that helps you out with RV storage and organization, this is a great place to come look. And then this is something else that I noticed in this particular aisle here. Now we love area rugs, but one thing that we've noticed with RV living is that they do tend to need to be replaced from time to time just because they get really dirty and it's hard to actually like have it cleaned while you're on the road. And so all sorts of discount rugs. I mean, some of these are super cute. I actually really like, look at this design. It's like kind of oceany. Look at that. How cute is this? I actually really like this. And it's only 20 bucks. Like that is such a great price. This would actually go really well in the RV too because of the ocean theme. It's white. That's the only problem. Ugh, that's the only problem. Oh look, that one's not white. Look at this one. 20 bucks. Oh, yeah. <gasps> what do you think? I like it. Mm -hmm. And this one would be really easy to shake out. All right, let's go see what else they have. So here is another thing that I just ran across that they have here that I feel like everybody needs for RV life. And that is one of these like folding step stool things. Now I can't tell you how many times that we have used our little folding step stool like this while RVing, whether it's like where we have the RV parked and it's just not super level. And then the stairs that you actually use to come in and out of the RV and you need like an extra step, whether you need to like reach something up higher on the RV, maybe clean something off. Or if you have a fifth wheel where it has really high cabinets and you're just not a super tall person, this kind of stuff comes in super handy. This one here is only $9 and it folds down. And so anything that folds down like this with RV life is totally your friend because it doesn't take up a lot of space. I just noticed this, this is super cool. Look at this, this is only $7.99 and this, it's actually a laundry bag. And so it's nice because it's soft sided so you could like collapse it down, fit it in a nice small space, but then you've got all of this room to carry laundry back and forth to the laundry room at the campground or wherever the laundry mat is. So that is a super cool idea and it's a cute design too look at that okay we're gonna go check out real fast but we're gonna go to the next store where i'm gonna show you some really cool finds for rv living and you're not going to expect where we're going to find them so stay tuned you have to take a look at this we are at marshall's and this is a great find they have all of these clear bins. Now these are specifically for like refrigerator organization, but take a look at this. You've got a pack of three clear bins here, which is great for the fridge for only $6.99. That is like such a good deal. And these types of clear bins can also be used for things other than just the fridge too, of course, but these are super nice to have in the fridge. And then like, look at this, this is like, you know, shaped more for like those corner spaces, just lots of really cool like fridge organization right here for super cheap at Marshall's. Here is a great tip when you are looking for things for RV storage organization is think things that flex like this and bend because lots of RVs, the space is just very irregular. So you want things that are flexible like this that you can shove into places and it's gonna bend and flex and give, but keep your things organized. So the prices here are fairly reasonable. Like this one's 10 bucks. That's not too bad for a nice rope 
soft-sided basket like this. So don't overlook marshals when you're thinking about RV storage and organization. So next up is Hobby Lobby. Now, I know what you're thinking. Wait a minute, that's like a craft store. Uh-uh-uh. We're actually using several things in our RV for organization and storage right now from the store. And I actually need to pick up a few more. So I'm gonna show you what they are, where to find them, and how you too can use them for RV storage and organization. So let's head inside. So this is actually a really fun thing to do when you're a Hobby Lobby. So you find the floral department because they've got all the florals, right? And then you just take like this selfie where it looks like you're in the flowers. <laughs> Trying to get it just right. There, I got some of the ceiling. If you would have had a free hand, I could have had you do it for me. Here's something else that they have at Hobby Lobby when it comes to storage and organization are they have a lot of these flexible bins too. And because this falls under the table decor, these are all 50% off this week as well. So you've got these larger soft-sided ones. This one is normally 60 bucks, so this would be 30 bucks right now. But all sorts of different types of bins that you can use for storage. There's all of these ones over on this side too. So lots of ways to stay organized with things here at Hobby Lobby. You guys, look at this. This is like seriously bin heaven right now. So many colors and look, 40% off all the bins i could just really go crazy in here but i'm going to refrain I'm going to hold myself back oh my gosh look at these and these are like flexible soft-sided too oh my goodness somebody's got to get me out of here Okay, so this is something that you always want to look for to save money at Hobby Lobby. So pretty much like every other week, they run these sales. So like right now, this week is 50% off of table decor. And that is what we're here for. That's the category it falls into. So when this week is over, they'll probably take these signs down and the next week will be like, say, wall decor. So if you come to Hobby Lobby and it's not on sale, just wait a week because then usually the next week, it's on sale. So let's take a look at what we came in here for. Should be down here somewhere, maybe over here. Where are they? Oh, here we go. All right. This, I love these. So we're actually using several of these like little wooden crates in our RV for storage. And what I actually have is this exact gray one. I actually have adhered to the wall next to the bed, kind of cr to create like a little bit of a nightstand effect because we don't really have like a nightstand that has like a pullout drawer. So using something like this, you could put things in it that normally you'd put in your drawer. So like I put my phone in here at night to charge, my Apple watch. I can usually fit like a book or something like that in here, some pens. So these particular wood crates, I love. They have them in the gray, they have them in the white. So like, here's like a little, like, you know, divided one. These are all super reasonably priced, especially if you make sure that you come on a week that it's 50% off. So this right now is $8, it's gonna be four bucks. So super excited about that, but these are amazing. And there's just all sorts of different bins and um, just, things like this that are kind of decorative. So, you know, when you're living the RV life, you also want your RV to feel cozy. You want it to feel like a home and a little bit less like a camper. So stuff like this can really go a long way with that. So it says a crowded camper is better than an empty castle. Isn't that cute? So that's the other thing they have here at Hobby Lobby is if you are looking for like decor for your RV, they do have some pretty cool stuff like this. So something people don't always think about, but we love using is a service like RV to be able to secure hard to get reservations. Now RV is an online travel booking agency where you can search, compare, and actually book over 3,500 campsites without paying any sort of booking fee. And the feature we probably love the most about RV is their sold out search feature. If a campground is sold out for the dates you're wanting to book, 
set up a sold out search in RV and RV will actually automatically book that campground for you when a cancellation happens and they happen more often than you think. We've personally used this sold out search feature several times with amazing success to secure last minute reservations or reservations for popular destinations. We've partnered with RV for a 10% discount for our viewers. Now this is an exclusive Grateful Glamper discount. So be sure to visit gratefulglamper.com forward slash RV or check out the link in the description below. And a huge thanks to RV for sponsoring this video. So the next place that we're gonna go check is here at Big Lots. Now I've been into Big Lots before. They tend to have things that kind of like come in and out. They don't have like products that are always consistently there, but I wanted to pop in here, see what they had today and really check out the pricing and see what is the pricing here for some of the organizational stuff look like compared to some of the pricing that we just saw, for example, over at Ross. So let's go check it out. First thing, we walk in and we have got some storage baskets. So the question here, this is a set of four. These are definitely nice storage baskets. A set of four for eight bucks. So that's like $2 a piece. Definitely better quality than you're gonna find like at the Dollar Tree. So, so far, that's actually a pretty good deal. Let's see what else we've got. Ooh, ooh look at this over here. These are kind of nice. So these are similar to Dollar Tree style, but definitely a little bit sturdier. So you got three of these for $7.99. Nice color too. Oh, and there's this too. Like this is kind of nice. And these ones are a little bit more on the flexible side. So we've talked about how when you're in an RV, having things that are flexible sided and they're not like super rigid sided is definitely your friend because it just makes it way more versatile as you're looking to organize that space. So here we've got some like rope type baskets now these ones actually show that they're on clearance for 15 so eh, a little bit maybe on the higher price side for some of those this one is not as flexible because it's got like that wire frame in the top but let's see what else we can find now here's some more baskets so these are actually on clearance as well these are 11.97 and these are nice because these are nice and flexible and so you could definitely store all sorts of stuff in those cupboards are probably one of my favorite places to put baskets because you know that saying about contents may shift during flight well especially on a travel day the last thing you want to do is go to open a cupboard and you get bombarded with everything that was in that cupboard so i really really like bins especially for those cupboard types of spaces to keep things like nice and neat on those travel days as things are moving around now these are kind of interesting. This is an interesting style that I've not seen before. So here you have a set of two of these and they've got like this cute little wood handle thing. And so that's kind of a nice bin. It's somewhat opaque. You can kind of see what would be in it as far as your contents are concerned, but it's definitely a little bit more on the decorative side than some of just the other plain bins that I've seen. So that's pretty cute, $6.97 on clearance. So definitely a pretty good buy. Oh, I just found the aisle. Here we go. So here we have all sorts of organizational bins. Now my eye is kind of drawn to this just because this has got some really funky patterns. It's kind of a little bit of a bigger bin. You probably wouldn't want to use this except for maybe like for closet storage or something like that. But I love the patterns on that. That is super, super fun. And then more of these bins that were up front. And then these rope bins. Now, this is kind of nice. It's like a set where you've got these other ones that nest in here. $16.99 for the set of three. So not the cheapest that I've seen, but definitely not the most expensive either. And it's nice, like sturdy rope fabric too. So that's nice. Some of these types of bins, you just be a little bit careful with that have these wire rims in them because they're not very flexible. And one thing that I am like not a fan of is these types of bins where it's narrower at the bottom than it is at the top because I just feel like if you have multiples of these stacked together, then you end up with like wasted space. Not a fan of this particular style where it's like that. Here's another thing that they actually have at Big Lots that I didn't even know that they had, but these types of storage bins with lids that are clear. Now we use a bunch of these for all of our miscellaneous camera equipment and things like that. So we have several bins and they stack up in our closet when we travel, 
But these types of bins, the clear ones especially, <laughs> this is your friend, especially also when you're storing it in the underneath basement compartments. These bins are really reasonably priced, $6.99, $7.99, like reasonably priced for sure. And then here's another thing that we use in our RV is this type of like rubber made sterilites the brand like dresser thing so we actually have one of these style of dressers if you will that we keep in the back rv closet because it's really easy to move if we need to move it because we have to be able to access our engine if we have a, an issue this is really nice and it's really reasonably priced i mean 28 dollars for essentially a whole dresser so that's a pretty good buy actually this is your father's day gift a giant thumbs up button Thank so if you're enjoying this video give it a thumbs up these are your friend so you can actually get something similar at the dollar tree but the dollar tree only just has two of these and then here you've got five of these and this is actually like this is metal it's not plastic so this is a lot heavier duty but there's so many things you can do with this they're really meant for brooms what i have actually been doing is using these to hang my plastic spray bottles and pulling this loop out this is actually a really cool little organizational tool and this is eight bucks. So reasonably priced, especially since this is metal and not plastic. So that's a cool little gadget at Big Lots. Now the next store up is Dollar General. Now I have not been in a Dollar General for a while. I do know that they've got some great stuff for RV organization, storage, just RV living in general. So kind of excited to head inside and see what's new and what we can find and see how expensive it is or isn't. Let's go. So I found the aisle with the things that we wanna take a look at. So here we've got some different types of organizational bins. Now again, not a fan of this style, but this style, ah, nope, that's got the wire in it too. Let's see, do we have anything that's more soft-sided, flexible? Not a lot, so, so far, this might not be the win that we're looking for. Let's keep looking around and see what else we can find. All right, so we found some more bins in this aisle here, but not a huge selection. And the other thing that I was noticing with some of these bins here too, so like you've got this here for five bucks. That's not exactly the bargain that we're finding in some of the other stores. So right now, this one might be a strikeout. I am like really a stickler for organization as if you've been watching this channel for any length of time, you probably know. So seeing some of this just totally stresses out my OCD heart. Next up, we are gonna check into TJ Maxx. Now, this is another one of those discount stores where sometimes the inventory can kind of change over time. I have not been into one of these for a while, so I'm kind of excited to see what they've got and if we can find some really good finds for RV life, let's go. Down this aisle, I'm seeing a few things that are kind of in that organization vein here. So we've got some like clear acrylic containers and stuff, but this caught my eye. So here you've got like where you've got a couple bins, but they're actually stacked in two drawers. So the question is $16.99 for this. Eh, it's not bad. I don't know if I would say it's a bargain, but definitely something that could be useful for organizing. Aha, found some more. Let's take a look at what we have down here. Now here we've got a lot more bins let's take a look those ones are rigid not a fan of stuff that's super rigid now this is kind of a cute little rope basket here with the bunny on it let's see twenty dollars that's actually not horrible for a, a rope bin that size but it's a little big probably only fit into a closet now these this is similar to those boxes that we were looking at at hobby lobby and this is only $6.99. This would actually be really cool mounting like on the wall or something similar to that. So that is actually pretty cute. I like this a lot. I'm trying to think of how I could use this. This is totally hurting my OCD, but you could also look at it as like a treasure hunt too, right? Like, could you dig through to find the treasure 
And maybe, maybe there's some buried treasure in here. You never know. It's like a treasure hunt. Now this is cool. This is some stuff you definitely want for RV living. So this is an over the sink drying rack. I have one of these, it just unfolds and you put it over the sink to like dry your dishes on. And then over here, anything that is collapsible is totally your friend. So here you have a collapsible bucket, eight bucks. It's definitely a great price on that. And then here's a collapsible colander. Again, anything collapsible, totally. And $2.99, that's actually a really good buy for a collapsible colander like that. In fact, I'm trying to decide if we need one because I don't have a colander. I usually just put the, like the lid of the pan over to drain off the water, but for $3 and it's collapsible, this actually might be the little treasure we were looking for in our treasure hunt today. So here is another cool find, I'm like waving my colander around now. These like baskets, so these are stacking baskets, but with the handles. So my parents are also full-time and they've done something similar with these where they've actually used brackets where the handles are and suspended them underneath of their cabinets to be able to store things like produce or whatever that you would want to store in the kitchen area. So these are actually really handy. And let's see, 10 bucks, 10 bucks for both of those. So actually that's really super reasonable. So we'll show you how my parents are using these and put a link in the description below for the brackets that they're using to hang those because that's pretty genius. And then over here, you've got these storage shelf um, dividers, I guess. I don't even know what to call it. We use these in the RV a lot because you do have a lot of cabinets where you've got all of this depth but then you're just not organized very well. So this actually works really, really well for those types of applications. And eight bucks for two of them. So it's actually a pretty good deal. These are really heavy duty too, by the way. Much more heavier than what you would find for like, I know the Dollar Tree has a version of this, but this is definitely heavier duty than the Dollar Tree. Here's another find, and that is these collapsible laundry baskets. Now I actually have one of these. This is $16.99, that's actually a pretty good price. I haven't checked the price on Amazon in a while, but I'm thinking I paid more for mine than this, which is kind of sad. But collapsible laundry basket. All right, I have to like, it's sometimes awkward. So there you go. So now you have your laundry basket and then when you're done, just collapse it back down and you can store it away nice and neat. So anything collapsible with RV life, totally your friend. So this is my new friend, the collapsible colander. And then look at this little mini waffle maker. We actually have a little mini waffle maker. I much prefer a mini waffle maker in the RV versus a full size waffle maker. So that is definitely something that can be your friend. So I found some more bins now. These are definitely nice. These are similar to the bins like that are at Ikea, but they're clear. Here's some more like bins that actually have lids that are clear. More clear organizers here. These ones actually stack. So these lids are actually hinged. Can't really take it apart because of the packaging, but they flip up and then flip down. So that's kind of nice because then they stay in place. So 12 bucks for this little what would you put in? caddy here. Well, I don't know, this is snack set. I mean, so you could put this like in the cupboard. You could put food in it. You could even use it maybe in the fridge to be able to like see what's in it. Fridge bins are also your friend because of the whole thing about things moving around as you're driving on travel days, especially just helps reduce like breakage and different things like that when you have things in bins in the fridge. So here's another place where you can find all sorts of bins. Now a tip is these types of soft sided bins. <laughs> like who are you waving to? I legit thought you were waving to somebody. I was. Me. Yourself. Saw myself in the mirror. All right, can we get back to the it's subject like matter? Young Sorry, poor guys. Garrett, Don't poor you. Garrett. Sorry, Garrett. <laughs> okay, we're good. And they've got other options too, so. Michael who? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> A nice ceramic thumbs up. <laughs> 
You'll have to let me know in the comments below which of these ideas or maybe what store is your favorite to shop for organizational types of things. I'm gonna put a video right up here with all sorts of ideas for RV storage and organization from Ikea. That's another place that you could find some really good organizational things. If we don't see you out on the road or around the campground, we'll see you in the next video.